Hello guys, welcome to this tutorial on how to write a cover letter for a civil engineering job. In this video, I will write a cover letter example focused on a civil engineering position. By doing so, I will effectively help you understand the formal requirements and structure. You can use this example for various positions, such as environmental engineer, structural engineer, or for instance, engineering manager. Now before I start writing the example, I first want to emphasize on five major keynotes for writing your own version. First off, use the cover letter format, which I will show you in a second. And when it comes to font and font size, choose Calibri, Arial or Times New Roman. You can also pick other simple and professional looking fonts. But remember that an applicant tracking system has difficulties reading complicated fonts, which might prevent your application from moving forward. Also. Use a 10 and 12 point size for easy reading. Second, thoroughly read the job description and make it match your profile. Seek for keywords that are mentioned more than once. These usually have a higher priority to the reader. Let the reader know that you are excited and motivated about the job opportunity and how you can contribute to their team and organization. Thirdly, understand the top five most important qualities and skills for civil engineers. That includes technical skills, project management, communication skills, creativity and critical thinking. Let the reader know which of these you excel and provide proven examples. Do not simply sum them up like in a resume, but provide context in numbers, percentages or awards you've been granted. Basically, make it measurable. Fourthly, it's highly important to understand who is the decision maker in the current stage of the selection process. Find out to whom you need to address the cover letter to. Check LinkedIn or the company's about us and staff pages to find out who posted the vacancy so you can communicate directly. It's also advisable to do proper research on the background and interests of this person. Because if you highlight the similarities between you and the recruiter, your chances of getting the job increases. This theory is also scientifically proven. At last, a formal cover letter should strive for an overall tone of voice that is confident, gorgeous and sincere. Alright, keep these top 5 keynotes in mind. If you have any questions related to these do's and don'ts, leave a comment down below. Now let's start writing the cover letter example, shall we? Now first off, start listing your contact information on the left, followed by the date of application between white lines. Then write down the recruiter's name and job function followed by the organization's information. As for the opening, write down Dear Mr. Abigail or Greetings Mr. Abigail. Key here is to know whom you need to address your cover letter to. Avoid openings like Dear Sir or Madam, Dear Hiring Manager or To Whom It May Concern. For a significant job in civil engineering, you better do some research. If you really cannot find a name, Consider calling the organization, express your interest and ask for a name. In the first paragraph you need to grab the reader's attention. Recruiters receive a ton of cover letters, especially in the engineering industry. Therefore, start with expressing your excitement about the job opportunity and or company and briefly inform them how you can contribute to specific requirements in the job description. Also, one thing every recruiter is interested about is how and where you found the vacancy. Let them know. In the second paragraph, shortly introduce yourself and briefly inform the reader about your experience. Then, let the reader know about your affinity with specifically civil engineering and when you switched into this specialization. Give some context to your career path and why this job opportunity could be beneficial for both parties. Focus on keywords that are listed more than once in the job description. These most likely have a higher priority to the reader. In the third paragraph, inform about your work experience, educational background and or extracurricular involvement. You can use these to highlight a match and prove that you are a good fit to the organization and the role. Key here is to not simply repeat what's on your resume, but to elaborate on stories and proven soft and hard skills. The soft skills of a civil engineer are for example, leadership and communication. Hard skills are for instance, the ability of reading and understanding complex drawings or performing mathematics to solve engineering problems. As for the conclusion, keep it short and sweet. Briefly summarize why you are a good fit and politely initiate an interview. 
tell the reader exactly what you want to discuss about, provide your contact information, and thank the reader for their time and consideration. End your letter with sincerely, or best regards, followed by your name and surname. Now in just several minutes you gained all information on writing a single page cover letter. Do not exceed the 400 words. Between 200 and 400 is the advisable word count. In this example I use 4 paragraphs. However, 3 would be fine as well. Now if you want this example in text format then click on the link in the description. Also, did you notice the matching cover and resume templates on the screen? These templates look neat and professional and can be downloaded. Again, check out the description for more information. Alright, I want to thank you for watching this video. And if you have any questions, leave a comment down below so that I can help you out. Also, if this video was helpful to you, do not forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe for more related content. Hopefully I will see you in my next video. Bye!